What is good, y'all? You dig what I'm saying? Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you go ahead and smash that subscribe button, hit this big thumbs up, and drop a comment in the comment section down below right now. But in today's video, matter of fact, let's go ahead and roll that intro, and then we'll get straight into today's video. So let's hit that intro. Y'all, you did. Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy J.I. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Enjoy the video. You did. Alright y'all, so in today's video, you know what I'm saying, we will be installing the Z28 front mesh grill, man. I'm super stoked to get this on the car. I've actually had it for a while. I wanted to put it on the car before I went to Dallas. If you guys missed those uploads, make sure you guys go check out the Dallas vlogs because I'm telling you they were bangers. SD card got corrupt and stuff like that, but you know, we bounce back and do what we can to make the video, you know, lit and live for y'all. But um i'm super stoked i want to go ahead and get that put on the car today try to do it once but the clips wouldn't unlatch to let the grill out it's ridiculous i don't know why it wouldn't work but if you guys haven't already make sure you go check out the instagram official underscore dot byl dot shop you do underscore byl dot shop it's on the screen right now get your uh any of the decals you put them on your car you can you know what i mean you can put them on your toolbox at work it don't matter bro so, with that being said, man, you already know, got my nice little setup. Let's go ahead, go to the car, turn the car around, get it aired up, and take the bumper off. All right, you guys, so while I wait for the bag's tank to finish filling up, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I'm talking about. So we are going to be replacing this grill right here, which will be getting rid of the Chevrolet bow tie and also my beloved SS. Huh. I hope I can put that on. I'm not 100% sure. We're going to see how it looks without them, and then we'll go from there. Don't mind the front end. I know it's covered in bugs. Again, just got back from Dallas, man. You dig what I'm saying? So when taking off the front bumper, you basically have a bolt right here. You have all of these push-in tabs. You have a bolt right here, and then there's three 10 millimeter bolts that go along the fender and the front bumper. There's a seven millimeter bolt right here and a 10 millimeter bolt right there. You go ahead and take all of them out, and then you'll have two 10 millimeter bolts at the bottom of the bumper as well. You take all of them out, and then the bumper comes out. So we'll go ahead and take the bumper out. I've done this out. So many times, you dig what I'm saying? I'm not gonna show you guys on camera. I'm gonna go ahead and take the cam the bumper off and then I'll cut the camera back on. What's up, Venom Vet Les? You dig what I'm saying? Pull it up. We got the Versatile Vet 2.0. As y'all can see by the tread wear down there. As y'all can see by that tread wear, something different. That don't look like a 22. No, not no more of them things gone. Why, why did you do that though? You know, it was bent, it was cracked. Goddamn heavy to race J.I. <laughs> okay. So, so do we just put the regular stocks back on or some, or some regular regular type? Yeah, or? put the regular stocks back on. Got the 19s in the back. Yeah. 18s in the front. Okay. So they are a little bit lighter, y'all. I wasn't able to pick the things that were one hand. We did end up painting them. Shout out to my boy J.I. for that idea, man. Ended up getting the gray steel to match the spider webbing on the sides, man. Then on the back. Kinda did a, a star look. Bro did a free a for all. Star look. Free for all. Yes, sir. Got the nittles all around too now, so hopefully Those your boy can grip. Those look good though. I can't count. Them joints do look good. I don't know. Maybe I mama needs some nittles. Hell yeah, that's too much wheel gap. Yeah. Maybe mama needs some nittles. I don't know. We're, I don't know, y'all. What y'all? Yeah, that your boy dropped a big, big bag, man, bro. Oh, That's a whole nother set of damn not, not rich ass. I'm trying to get like you, shit. But yeah, man, let's pull it up. I'm finna go ahead and finish taking the bumper off, and then I'll get back at y'all. All right, y'all, you dig what I'm saying? So got the bumper off. 
finna take it inside the shop. My boy Paul is gonna help me try to get this grill out because I swear it's stubborn as hell. And then we put the new one in, bolt everything back up. Obviously, we got terrible weather or I would have washed Mamba for a nice little, you know what I mean, quick B-roll edit for y'all. But yeah, them clouds, I don't have that much time. So let's get it. Got my man Paul on the job, man. You already know Paul get it done. That boy, the Mr. Miyagi of cars. That's all we here 24-7. See if we can get them hoes out. Oh shit, nigga. I'm mean, fucking my paint now. <laughs> man, say, man, let's get a goddamn thank you, Paul, in the chat. Got the old grill out. The, the piece of shit grill we don't give a damn about. Got it out. Now it's time to put the new mook in there. I've been thinking, y'all comment down below and let me know. I've been thinking about doing something with this lower grill down here. Y'all let me know if I should, man. Uh, so this out? little, yes sir. This little metal um, trim right here. Getting rid of that. And then there's one that goes, another piece that goes at the top. Getting rid of that. I just feel like, I just want it all the way gone. Have a complete clean, all black look, man, for real. Ugh. Pop that trunk. Uh, old grill. So I'm gonna ride with no emblems for right now. See how I like it. Um, but for right now, I actually like it, man. It looks it looks great to me. Let me show you guys real quick. Now keep in mind the car is freaking filthy, but drum roll, please, drum roll, please. Damn. Whoa, that hoe just gave out. Oh, bitch, no, don't. They ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. All right, y'all, so my fog light doesn't want to go red anymore, so we're going green today. <laughs> but I just want to go ahead and show y'all, man. Look at that grill. Oh, that mesh. Looks so good, so clean, man. But without further ado, y'all, that's actually gonna do it for this video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button, hit that big thumbs up, and let me know down in the comment section down below what you guys think about the new look. How does it look, man? Y'all like it? Y'all don't like it? Let me know. Let me go back to red just for this side right here. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. It looks good. What you think, Les? VVL approved? Fucking right. But with that being said, y'all, that's gonna be it for this one. If you're new to the channel, like I say, smash that subscribe button. We'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.